Go, go, Power Rangers! Earn, 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 earn. This is Sean Long of Longshot Dreams. And I'm bringing another Mighty Morphin Power Rangers toy review. This time, another Mighty Morphin Power Rangers 2010 Morphin Red Ranger. When the new Mighty Morphin Power Ranger toys came out, of course, they had all the characters from the original show and they had the new Megazord. And they came out with a whole bunch of uh, toys and characters or things that weren't in the original show. Like, I know that in later in the show in the Thunder Zords, um, the Red Ranger gets the Red Dragon Zord, but he never turned into a Red Dragon. So, but I love Power Rangers. I love Transformers. So why not a Red Dragon uh, that turns into the Red Ranger? So here we got it in its Dragon Mode. The paint apps are pretty good. It could have some more paint detail in the Dragon face, but the teeth are very sparkly. You can see here it has a lot of gold on it with the gold wings and. And you can see his little claws, which will be his arms, and then the legs here. And you can see his tail, which has, it's it's pretty a little weird that it's red, and then it has the gold, but it has some cool, uh, but in, in all in all, it's a pretty cool dragon mode, and it's actually the best they even display in this mode. It's uh, If you just like dragons, it's it's really cool. The articulation in dragon mode, um, it doesn't have any head articulation, unfortunately. The arms do rotate all the way around and go in and out, bend at the elbow and uh, rotate at the uh, wrist, but that's because it's the arms. And the dragon legs do rotate and go in and out a bit, and the tail goes uh, is articulated at this uh, joint right here, and uh, this joint, uh, be, and these will be the legs. And then the wings also can um, can go up and down and also fully rotate. So that's uh, it's pretty good articulation. So you can get some cool uh, dragon poses like "Roar!" My breath is so bad it will burn you alive. You also get this clear translucent red phoenix. Uh, thing it's it's pretty cool it's it's a bunch of a little attachments but you can see a phoenix head and it has little wings that because it's this is made of uh, four uh, different pieces so the wings are articulated and it, ha it looks pretty cool on its own but there's a purpose for this guy it's made for battle dragon mode you want to take off uh, the pieces right here so take them off the tab in front has a little hole right in here so you want to tab that into place there's a hole on the side right here with the little tab for each little wing you just slip it in here do the same for the other side and last but not least this little hole for the tab for the tail you just slip it in here and there you got battle dragon mode yeah! you can see that the added uh, translucent pieces give it a cool little fiery effect especially in the tail and it actually looks really cool like I said uh, if you really like dragons then um, definitely get uh, this uh, just for the display like that it's it's really cool so yeah this dragon is on fire just like the box that it transforms I mean morphs into the Red Ranger so let me show you how it transforms I mean morphs so you take off the little pieces on the ends right here so let's take off all the little pieces now what we're gonna do here let's start with the legs so we're gonna open up his tail and then we're gonna fold in the legs uh, here which will form the feet and you can see it's already forming. We want to bring the dragon legs down. And we want to bring his arms down. It's really easy transformation. Bring it down. Or do you want to untab from the back here? Open it up. You want to open up the chest and bring his head back and bring the dragon head back. Close up the chest. There we got the Red Ranger back in his uh, Ranger mode. You can see that the detail on here is just like the four inch uh, figures. You can see it's really nice. Uh, the head sculpt in there. The chest is a little different, has like a green somewhere right here and some white abs and yeah, it's a little different style but it, it's cool like dragon armor and especially in the shoulder pieces and you can actually lift, even though the dragon head's up here, you can lift up the wings to give it a cool like, I can fly mode, red dragon flying mode now, <sighs> yep. And then uh, you can see here his feet are kind of, you know, more, you know, dragon like and um, but really cool. I, I really like the look of it. It's definitely different, but um, that's very cool. For articulation, the Red Ranger's head can rotate all the way around. Fortunately, cannot go up and down. His arms can rotate all the way around, go in and out, uh, bend at the elbow, rotate uh, fully at the wrist. Uh, no waist articulation, unfortunately. His legs can go forward and back, in and out, uh, bend at the knee here, and um, that's pretty much it. Lords and Reaver Pulsar at it again. Time to form Battle Ranger mode. We're gonna take all the little pieces here. We're gonna tab this part in to um, the chest. And once we got that in the chest, we'll take the little wing parts here and we'll put them on the side 
on the back here where we had it in the dragon mode. Do the same on the other side. And what's really cool with the little tail piece or head of the phoenix mode, you can use it as a cool little sword and it fits nicely in this hand. And here we got battle dragon mode. It's so freaking awesome. It'll make your head explode. Red Ranger, Goldar, you want to fight? Come get it. Battle Ranger mode. Time for super awesome Ranger mode. So many awesome explosions, Michael Bay would be jealous. Size comparison time, so here you can see the Morphin Red Ranger is definitely bigger than his 4 inch uh, counterpart, uh, but a little smaller than a 6 inch Iron Man uh, movie figure or a Transformers Deluxe. Now the Morphin Red Ranger is a cool concept, I mean they have these in the blue, uh, black, and the green rangers. They all transform into dragons and besides the red and green ranger, it doesn't make much sense that the blue and black ranger have dragons, but anyway, besides the point, uh, the fact that you get a pretty cool uh, transforming um, dragon that transforms into a pretty articulated ranger with cool little add-on weapons, I think it's a pretty good deal. These guys run for about 15 bucks. You can get them at Target, Toys R Us, uh, Big Bad Toy Store, and I definitely would recommend it if you like Transformers and Power Rangers. Def def definitely, this is the way to go in, the in these figures. Hope you guys enjoyed my review. Stay tuned for more Power Ranger reviews. This was our toy review. Subscribe to my channel if you like. This is Sean Long saying until next time. Hey guys, wonder where I get all my amazing toys? Well, I get them at BigBadToyStore.com or BBTS for short. For all your needs, whether it's Transformers, DC, Marvel, GI Joe, and more, go to BigBadToyStore.com. They accept PayPal and they do pre-orders, and they're just Awesome! Jason, what the hell? You know that I have the dragons, or why are you copying me with this whole dragon crap? Sorry, Tommy, but I'm the leader, so haha. -ha. Then it's time to enter the dragon. What is that music? Me Grimlock like music and to eat red dragons. No, 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 no. Well, that wasn't the dragon's orb, but that's what you get for messing with the Green Ranger, biatch.